<sighs> so this is, uh, what did you wish you knew about each other before embarking on this challenge? Well, unlike a lot of couples on this planet, me and Joanna, good or bad, as people would say, we spend nearly every minute of our lives together for probably the last three years. And no one does that. I mean, seriously. Maybe there's a few people that are hardcore that way, but... Yeah, he doesn't really let me do anything on my own. I, I monitor her <laughs> and take care of her every, every... Sammy! So do the birds. Sammy! They come with us everywhere. <laughs> so it's, it's just always been... Ever since I met her, I'm like, I'm... We do everything I'm almost together. afraid to leave her by herself, and I need her too. I mean, when I go to the dentist, she has to be there, and I'm not was never like that before. When I get a facial, he's there. When when <laughs> when, when she's any type of medical thing, any type of thing, you know, I'll be in the dentist office. I'm like, where's 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 my baby? Where's she at? And I never used to be like that, so I'm, now I'm codependent. No, I guess. no, I was never like that. Really? Fiercely independent. Yeah, I didn't need anyone, but now I do. So that's all your fault. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I've always been quite independent myself. Yeah, I know. But we know each other. Like I've told people before, I I can write the book on Joanna, and I'm I know everything. So that helps. But in a situation that we had to deal with emotionally and physically with the environment, it's tough. It doesn't matter how much you know about someone, you still have to struggle to try to make it work. And we did a miracle again. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>